melletti városba, de itt bent a kerületben nem szívesen élnék. I told you that I also lived in Budapest, but I moved to a city near Budapest, but I would not like to live here in the district. Uh, yes, okay. A, még eléggé megváltozott, volt egy idő, amikor a város fejlődött, és itt a kerület is egyre jobb lett. Az utóbbi időben nagyon sok ö, negatívuma volt, koszosabb lett a város, mm, olyan emberek, hajléktalan emberek egyre többet vannak, akiknek nincs hol lakniuk, és hogy az utcán ö, egyre több olyan ember van megint itt a keletbe, aki egy időben eltűnt akik uh, rontják a kerületnek, illetve itt a környéknek a... A talok költöznek ide, van sok, aki régóta és idősebb itt él, de lassabban cserélődik itt a ember. A szám, igyeben itt a keletben nagyon sok uh, jó módú tehetős és sok ember él, nagyon sokan elköltöztek ki a város szélére, illetve messzebbről is jártak vásárlók. Főleg az emberek piacokon, illetve a régi közértekbe vásároltak, ezek a nagy multi cégek áruházai nem voltak. Um, Hungary was a wonderful experience. It really was. Yeah, that's I all I gotta that. say. I agree with that. That's all there. Yeah. I used to live here actually, in the Eighth District around here. Yeah. Which part? Yeah, in um, um something Samuel. Dio Dio Sege. Dio Sege Samuel. Yes, and it was infamous because it was there was so much crime back like oh ten, my God, yes. ten years ago. So I got, I was fortunate enough to avoid that. But, but not even still then. Some, but anyway, it was dangerous where I, where, where I was living. Yeah. So. yeah. I used to live here like a little bit ago, like maybe nine months ago. And I think that honestly, everywhere that you walk in Budapest, there's going to be, like when you don't understand the language, there's going to be people that you think are like, oh my God, like what are they going to do because they're screaming in Hungary or whatever. Yeah. But you really never know, and nothing ever happened in the eighth district. I've had things happen in many other districts, but yeah, knock on wood. <laughs> but but here it was it was fine. Like it's, I think it's intimidating going anywhere when it's late at night in a yeah city that you don't know the language.
the crimes that are happening here are just really average. And um, because I think that because of the history of the 8th district, how bad it was, yeah. people are afraid. And the 8th district is famous about that uh, minorities are living here. So like foreigners, refugees, um, students, because it's cheap, because people are afraid of this district. They are living here. And uh, for, for that reason, uh, people are just like, confused when they are on the street and they are assumed that somebody is going to attack you and when you have the suspicious look then the other is thinking that oh you want to attack me when it's it's nothing like that not not at all Um, my name is Máté Hegedűs, uh, I am from Budapest, I use they them pronouns, now I'm working for Budapest Pride. Aurora is a place to, to, to find community and um, to share knowledge, um, to be with other people and who I know that are sharing the same values as me. It's a really accepting place, so I feel safe um, or safer. Yes, I think it's, it's really relevant in the current political situation. It was a lot of time attacked in a way of like politically trying to, to stop this place from like growing and working and, and creating this safe space for communities. place only has an opinion about the Hungarian government. It's not against it, it only has an, an opinion and it just wants to stand. <laughs>